Hello everyone to a new series of Civilization 5. It's been a long time since uploading YouTube videos in general, but here's the start and in the future we will branch off onto many other games and many different ideas. So let's first off start here in single player. Civilization 5 a game, it's a complete edition, all the DLCs. I'm not sure what the whole version is called when you buy all the DLCs, but yes, it was I think for the Christmas special where Steam had a good good sale. So now let's set up a game first here. Um so we first need to choose a country. Um, personally, you can choose whoever you feel like. Um, but I think I would rather go something more exciting, something more closer to home. I'm not sure. Let's just stick with something. Lem. Old wonders. All of these people have separate benefits towards them. Um, let's just first see. Who could be very interesting? The Vikings. The Berserkers. Ski Infantry. Oh, it looks very interesting. Hmm. Definitely not India. Um, let's just see who there is here. There's so much to choose from. We could go something conservative. But let's, I think, one of the bottom people did interest me slightly more. I'm not sure who it was, but, um... Zulus, the Korean army, Egypt. Well, let's just stick ahead and go something simple. Like Napoleon. He seems like a solid choice, Napoleon, and the French Empire. We will choose a map with the whole earth. And we will take the biggest. Huge 12 players, yes. Let's just go with um, a normal difficulty of Prince. And the... Standard, yes, the standard speed, advanced setup, is there anything? No, I don't think there should be. Start information, atomic error. I mean, there is so much to it, but we will start straight from bottom. Let's just spawn here. Is the choice? Actually, falling in Waterloo. Finally, the introduction is done. We will lead the country to glory and greatness. Well, he definitely didn't stand the test for. So begin your journey. So now we spawn here with both a settler and um, a warrior. So warriors can move. So these ruins give us special benefits. Yes, we've got 20 culture. So now we need to just check. I feel like this is actually a decent place to start off with. I feel like we were spawned into... Yes, I think this is actually a perfect place. Usually you can move your guys. So Paris. Let's Paris is the start. And eventually we will go exploring. Choose production of your city. If you don't know the game. Monumentum. We should get some early... Um, I do feel like we should get some early... What is that? Or scouts out. Scouts are a very good early unit to get. Choose the research we want to do. Excuse me. Thank you. Um, I will most likely go with pottery. It's a very important aspect of your... Excuse me. Of the people. Yes, I know. So, as you can see, if you click on the city, we are here put into this. So here, we get reminded that... So basically what it is, you have settlers that settle on your pieces of land. Currently, we can't really choose. Wait, citizen management here. Food focus. And that is what we will be focusing. Gold, there's all these different focuses. Food generally grows your cities a lot larger. Production makes everything build faster, so you start to evolve a lot faster. And gold focus, you can buy a lot of items of gold in the game. So currently we only have one citizens, and it will still take us a couple of turns of going anywhere. So now next turn. Let's continue. Let it load. Okay, there we go. Um, our workers can slowly start ex 
slowly start exploring the area. There's not much else to do other than exploring in the early pieces. That is why you get yourself an early, early um, scouting troop. So you can just view the land. Because getting those early... Uh, what are they called again? Monum... The... The ruins are actually really good to get. And it does give you maybe... It gives you views of trading with other people. Which at the moment we have nobody to trade with. So it's very sad. And like as you can see we hardly... We have hardly explored any b bits of the area. And I will move down here. Future here. I we're just busy waiting for the scouts. Because they can then control the north. As we go along we I will explain more and more. Policies are basically... Trees of points. They shape your civilization in a way, as it says. You'll spend your accumulate culture points to unlock social policies. Culture points, it, and again, it gives a lot of benefits. So here, allowing tradition is best for small empires. Liberty, honor. I'm not sure what is a really good... So these will only be unlocked when we hit the specific errors. So I think we will adopt um, we'll grant adopting all policies we'll grant 15% growth in all cities so tradition is I think the first tree we want to finish uh, we'll greatly increase so we will s grow a lot quicker which is very good for this time of the day so let's just expand three more turns until we hit city growth and one more turn for the scout which is very good to see to come along Soon our city will s start growing with a second citizen. Our capital city has finished building a unit. As you can see, we have finished units. So we can now possess to workers. Workers are very important, and they will take a while. So scouts basically don't have unaffected movement speed, so that's why they're so good early game. So here we find... We'll first head to the runes before attacking the barbarian encampment and yes I think that is it L let's just see I, have some information that may be of use. I think it feels like this is the best option right now yes you're choosing the original one it also gives us more production which is also pretty decent for the moment <sighs> let's move quickly over here the game always basically procs you to do to move all of your units. And you can put people in, sta in, the, in a sleeping position so you don't have to bother about them. Especially very useful later on in that. Later on when you have the issue of, of having a lot of units to control. Let's see what we get. Oh, we just got pottery. Which provides food, helping cities grow larger. Secrets of advanced technology. Choose research. We will carry on. The Archer, the first ranged unit. I think mining is very important. I do feel like plantations are also... Yes, plantations actually. The calendar. Very interesting. We did get advanced. There we go. More runes. You receive 795 gold. So, sorry for the quick, quick break. Um, but we're back here now. Um... So now, as you can see, we have two citizens, we have good, we have even more growth, and your city will start growing a lot more because we have so much, so many apples. But let's, we first need to wait for the worker, and now let's do the next turn. Everything is done. Soldiers will walk over there. Scouts will scout a little bit further. They discovered it's a dead end. So they'll move on. It seems like we're in a little bit... Like, there's a mountain range between us and wherever the rest is. But we cannot see that for sure now. Fortified units are just stronger units than your original units. And yes, they work off. As you can see, there's two here. So we can keep on attacking. We did manage to have a victory there, I believe. Yes, we did. We can always just recover the units later on. And they do gain experience every time they do fight. So more experienced units mean better units in general.
pretty close. We actually that was pretty close to a draw. Let's see. There's more ruins. That's always great to discover. Let's see what the barbarians unit now decide to do. We're still waiting a couple of couple of turns for everything else. Mm. Let's just cross straight to the ruins. You found survivor. Oh, that is amazing. Increasing its popular. That is great. One of your combat units is near an enemy ruin. Yes, I know. Minor victory. One more soldier of theirs left. Adopting a policy. 15% production when building wonders and 1% one happiness for every 10 citizens. That only applies very later. So right now there isn't much of a benefit. And it's just, this is a sole point. Mm. Prize of culture building. Well, we need to get onto here, onto this line, to do anything. So, uh, well, plus one gold and one for every two citizens. Capital. Monarchy. <laughs> That's very true to a real monarchy. Although this, both these points won't help much at the moment. But yes. Next turn. As you can see our city, our Paris is slowly expanding. Oh shit. They did fall. Combat strength in rough terrain. Let's move the brutes away. The issue is he needs to regen HP. We discovered an encampment. That is not great news because they will attack our scouts. So anything that steps just outside your base will be attacked by your s capital city. We are faster than the units so we can. Zurich. They don't interact. They basically are just like neutral ground but you can trade with them really well. Irrational. You you get thirty gold meeting them. That is great news. Fortified until healed. Sittens produce unhappiness, while luxury items in some building provide happiness. Yes, there is up here. You'd always have to try push that. Yes, I did. I did heal it. Thank you. Thank you. Contact the civil city. Center. Hmm, it's to protect. Okay, we did pledge to protect them, which is good for the moment because we don't need to get any enemies. That's for the next turn. Good, good. Um, what else? Let's just wait here. Um... <laughs> what the hell? Oh shit, we're in their land. Let's get out. Let's... Ex uh, they will keep on healing. We have a lot of turns to wait now, so... It'll just be general scouting. But as you can see, terrain is filled with... Um, the terrain is filled with a lot of special resources. They just give you dyes, but you need to... You need certain science technology to get these certain elements as well as anything anything that is besides jungle and you can chop down a jungle basically most fields are very interactive with so you don't leave your fields like this but right now you still have to wait we are looking that is not much of an issue right now let's just see if this is a dead end maybe there is like a gap to get out of a it feels like we're South America. So, yes. Um, recording has... Let's see what... A unit needs order. Oh, we just need to see... Oh, this is a dead end. That is very annoying. You can only pass there with a boat. So you can... There's not... It's not a dead end completely. But we will be heading back. Next turn. Oh, we did discover something else. Greetings, stranger. I am Harold Bluetooth. Oh, Bluetooth. Ha <laughs> ha. 
Yes, I will trade with you, Bluetooth 3.0. What music files would you like? Rule of the Danes. Do you like to my long ship? It has crushed a thousand of my endless. Declare war. Yeah, let's go. No, just kidding. Um, trade? Demand? What are we supposed to trade? I have nothing. Goodbye. See you soon. Oh, we are busy going in another turn. Often there's a lot of loading time, and so it can process a lot during turns, because the more people you meet, the bigger the world gets, the more heavier it becomes on your PC, so the game does internally start to more struggle in terms of that. Next turn? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's very interesting. Calendar. To contract. To wisdom. Oh. The Bible. Oi. The Bible. Uh, which are extremely important for growth and happiness. Not many reasons require you to have chopped the forest or jungle first, which requires other technologies. And we're heading south again. Choose research. Oh, very interesting. Writing. Embassies. Sailing. No, sailing is not important. Construct binds to increase the production of map tasks. Chop forest along. I think mining is very important right now. Mm. Two more turns until our city does grow, which in turn offers more prosperity and growth. We have been attacked, but it is a fight we shall not lose. Very interesting, the working unit should come around about soon. We will move around the continent. Here we go. Here are your first workers. Um, choose production. The granary. I meant uh, more. B you don't need more. Uh, not more workers for now. Granary momentum. Let's try a momentum. It feels like. It is maybe a good thing because it does give us more culture. We shall attack because we shall win this fight. Good, good. Then we can fortify our units again. And keep on attacking and gaining experience for the unit. We have met Harold Blute if he's actually smiling the most. Keeping us... We should be at the bottom, yes. That is not great news. Well, I'm already headed, heading to be a dictator. That's excellent. Ambiguous, no. Mm, ranged. Mm, I'm just thinking. Defense against ranged attacks. I think it's rough terrain. I think they will die. Okay, they did die. That is good news. We can't do anything because we don't have. Plantation yet. That's very interesting. 21 turns now for something. That is a long, long while. Mm, nothing we can actually do yet with workers. So we actually did... We should have rushed um, the mining a lot earlier. So I think that was crucially a mistake from us. Smart attack, yes. We have we can. A worker, but have not improved any tires yet. Order your worker to mm. an improvement on a tire near one of your cities to gain an extra I'm just seeing what I can potentially build. It feels like I can build nothing. Something I'd have to wait three turns for. I feel like we're stuck in here, so No, we cannot busy we cannot actually do anything right now. That's very interesting. Mm. Okay, this is a... Paris is slowly starting to grow quite a bit. Um, our scouts... Wait, I hope they don't get attacked. We made up the policy. Provides a free culture building in your first city. What culture building have we received? Free. Oh, free momentum. 
the granary. Each source of wheat produces plus one. I think that is something next to hit for. Mm, yes, I think very good. Mining one more turn. That is actually excellently. We're slowly coming on. Paris is slowly starting to grow. I think we will leave them to sleep. And next turn. Processing sit turn for city states. And let's go, let's go. They did not attack one. Okay. Choose research. Mm, the caravan. We do have them in our lands. Archers are not too important. The cargo ship is not too important either. Helping the empire reach more. Masonry, walls, marbles, clear marshes. Bronze work, no. The spearmen. Let's see what they... I personally feel like this is very important because we do have some animals in our land. That's already the next turn right there. We're already 30 turns throughout the game. And I think it's been a very, very long day already. Let's just give these people a job. Let's move them down here. Although there's nothing to to do there, so... So I think this has been quite a long episode. I would I would appreciate it if I was told in the comments if you guys prefer longer or shorter videos, what else to improve, what other game suggestions. I'm open to literally any suggestions. Um, whatever you feel like putting out there. And yes, I will see you next time, I'm guessing. And it's bye from Tech Technology. Until next time. Yes.